So this is my car prior to any real washing. It is sprayed off, so there's a little bit of uh, cleanliness now. Uh, just go ahead and do a walk around what I noticed from the car. So there's a curb rim now. See rash, right? Uh, again, I got to get the car clean to see if there's any damage to the paint. This paint is less than a month old. Uh, right here, you can see some bowing in my fender where it slapped that ramp. So this whole fender bowed out when it came down on that ramp. So we'll get that. Uh, as you can see, my hood is misaligned. That is fiberglass. So it pinched in some of the corners and popped out here when this fender bowed up. Uh, so I'm going to have them check the hood for stress fractures and see if it's structurally integrity. Uh, in general, the car looks like it's been through hell. Uh, the windows were completely rolled down on the passenger side, halfway down on the driver's side on the transport truck. We'll get in the car in a minute. Uh, it does smell pretty bad. Uh, the bumper. So I noticed a few smashes where it hit. That's contact from that uh, ramp and getting off. Uh, going to a collision shop today to see what's going on. But front clips broken. Grinding on the, the bumper. Uh, that's my radiator support right there. That's uh, bent. And that's a drainage hose for my catch can that's smashed up into the radiator. Again, looking at the front bumper. You can see it's popped out. It's misaligned, so the whole front bumper is smashed upwards. Uh, headlights. That's what it should look like, nice and flush towards the bottom, popped out, popped out, so headlights are going to have to be adjusted. Uh, this was the first tire that contacted the shipping ramp. I actually yelled at him to stop, stop, because uh, he was rubbing this tire. This is the one that fell off first. Uh, down here again. Uh, it contacted underneath on this side, not so much higher up like it did on the other side because this side came off first and the other side got the worst of it. Uh, looks like a small crack there. Again, the weight was supported right about here on the on-ramp. I have pictures of that as well. The only tire that didn't receive uh, any impact was this one. It still looks good. This is what... My tires did look like, uh, again, there's a little bit of dirt. This isn't marring or anything. It's just dirt. But uh, rims and car was freshly painted one month ago. Nothing to the back. Okay, so opening it up. So... If you see here, all that little stuff right here, this is inside the car. This is where that water line just sat and sat. You can't really smell it right now, but it smells pretty bad in here. Uh, it's from all that rainwater just soaked in down there. Uh, this is after I vacuumed it, but uh, definitely some water damage over there. Uh, you can see just where the rainwater was hitting and just pouring in. So it actually left a little calcium deposits. Appreciate that, guys. Shipmyauto.com. That's what they fucking give you.